still nothing from So Me. Radio silence. She's never gone dark this long. Troubling, to say the least. So, what if Songbird don't show? We need to wait. It's all we can do for now. If she doesn't show, well... Then... I'll have one other option to consider. But let's table it till morning. We should get some rest. <laughs> Surreal. All of it. What's that? I'd have been home by now. Reading the evening brief, glass of water and two sleeping pills waiting on the night table. Doesn't sound like you miss it much. <sighs> See you in the morning, V. She's on the balcony. She's not here. I Means she's not coming. Been, what, 12 hours since the crash? Enough time to flee Dogtown, that's sure. She'd never leave me behind. Protocol? Friendship. I need to find her. You don't leave your people behind enemy lines. Could I still buy that fairy tale bullshit? Whatever happened, we have to help her. Got a talk backup plan. Not a plan, a man. The kind we need. Solomon Reed's the name. Seven years ago, he headed up our intelligence efforts in Night City. He and Somi were a team. With the conflict over, he went into hibernation. So he's out there somewhere. Reed's a man of principle. He can't be swayed, can't be bribed. If there's anyone we can trust now, it's him. Sleeper agent. No shit. Tell me more. Unless it's like a state secret or whatever. It is. Of the false bottom drawer variety. Let's say you want to secure your interests on another country's soil. If diplomacy fails, you resort to other means. Like a military coup? That's one option. Solomon Reed is another sure one. Reed guy sounds like an ace up your sleeve. Could have played him already. Activating a sleeper agent is no simple matter. You'll need a dog whistle. A what now? Don't tell him I called it that. It's a signal only Reed will hear. It'll be tricky. Huh. There was a secret comms channel accessed only from a Capitan Caliente nearby. The FIA used it before the war. The access code was... 0931. Got a bad feeling, V. Sounds way overcomplicated. Gotta be an easier way. We'll call the FIA secret agent hotline and dial his extension. No, this is the only way. Mm-hmm. So what'll happen next? Reed will need to screen you. You'll show him this. It means you work for us. What the? A file will be created for you in the FIA database. Wait, back up. Telling me I'm a special agent now? That's right. But taking the oath make it feel more real. Seeing as we're on the same side, can't hurt. Oh, V. Repeat after me. 
I, V, do hereby solemnly swear. I, V, do hereby solemnly swear. To faithfully serve the new United States of America. Fucking pathetic. To faithfully serve the new United States of America. I vow to uphold the values set forth in the nation's constitution and represent its government with dignity and due diligence. I vow to uphold the values set forth in the nation's constitution and represent its government with dignity and due diligence. I pledge to defend my country against all enemies, foreign and domestic. Should this cause claim my life, so be it. I pledge to defend my country against all enemies, foreign and domestic. Should this cause claim my life, so be it. On behalf of all NUS citizens, I thank you. Good luck out there, V. And don't let the bastards nab you. Sleep okay. Night all right? Like any with a roof overhead. Claustrophobic. As for Jacob, he thrives in dreamland. Come on, baby. Ever ridden in a rayfield? My villa with VIP friends? High society? On and on till the crack of dawn. Not man with ambitions, clearly. Those in a deviated septum.
You know, taking that oath, bad idea. Oh, yeah? Some causes are worth pledging your life to, V. This ain't one of them. Yeah, yeah. Fuck the system, fuck our Osaka, fuck the NUSA. Jesus Christ, V, this ain't some teenage anarchist boot camp. No, I was once a corpo jarhead, right? Practically dove into uniform head first. They had a real hard on for the oath. Repeat after me, bloody fucking blah. But can't remember what I solemnly pledged to do. Sure, you want to talk about this? Forget it. You were just do a chewing out. That crazy color smoke? Yep. Wham bam. One of Hanson's cargo drops, no doubt. She all yours. I sure as shit ain't making that climb. Well, thanks for the heads up. Maybe I'll take a look. Sure thing. Again with my favorite Merc this side of the Sierra Nevadas. Uh, only did the one gig for you, as far as I recall. Hmm. And let's not forget our torrid tale of Haitians, Netrunners, and animals. You could not have made contact with the VDBs without me. Your source for adventure I am, in Dogtown as elsewhere. So, we finally gonna meet in person? I can say neither yes nor no. In lieu of an answer, I've new work for you. I hope you'll accept. One last thing. How you breached Dogtown's border, I'm not certain. Though I suspect not via the main gate. Irrelevant in any case. I've secured clearance for your future convenience. Your name and likeness now registered in the system. Granting unfettered passage over the district threshold. Talk again soon.
after we get the fuck out of here. Nah, we would tell the speech just lives you in shit. Favor here, favor there. Chumba, my ex brother in law. It was a simple misunderstanding, really. I want to be fair. Fuck the course. Shop low. Shop with Ronald, Ronnie. Capitan Caliente. Guy clearly went down with this place. Stash house, by the looks of it. Right. Let's see what's here.
What's this? Antique. Junky variety. Wonder if it even works. I'll have a double cheeseburg while you're at it. Uh, anyone there? Hello? Fossil's probably busted. Or you flubbed the number. What the fuck do we do now? Who's this? Call me V. Not exactly loquacious, our man of mystery. Could just prefer text. Damn sure I do.
Once his elbow has a hitch, dude needs an upgrade. Rico hitch today? Oh, not a doubt in my mind, it'll hitch. With the right guns installed, man, a three-point dunk ain't even hard. Game needs some damn rule changes. Where were you when it crashed? On the net. Traffic blew up like crazy. Almost made my ice back boil. What's the word? Was it really the NUSA? I don't know. Best seats in the house. Yeah. As crazy as it is out here. Gonna be a game to remember. Johnny Silverhand, basketball fan. That's new. You know what I mean. Everybody. Another game starting. One where your head's the fucking ball. You always said we could use another window. Thought the same thing. Something nasty's brewing. Fucking storm's what's brewing. Don't let the sunshine fool you. You're up against seasoned players, whereas you just stumbled onto the court. These are trained sociopaths. Pretend to be your friends while they fucking ain't. So go out and play. Just don't get played. Just come out and say it. You don't trust Myers. No, her type is all. Politicians. Worse, armed forces. Saying no to high-ranking cunts like putting your mouth over the barrel of their gun. Get shitty fast if you try to run. Take it from a deserter. The dauntless Johnny Silverhand, scourge of Megacorps. Here we go. Vanquisher of hypocrisy. Bolted from the army? Give this man his fucking encore. Gonku enlisted was Robert John Linder. Got roped in with easy cash, promise of fame, glory. Linder snuffed it. Was a different kid who crawled home from the front. Johnny, I... I didn't mean to... It's okay. Was a long time ago. One thing I did learn, caked in blood and mud. What was that? After every carrot comes the stick. Allow me to illustrate. Every grunt gets a rifle, flak jacket, and a bunch of promises. Comes a time you're out of ammo, Kevlar's tattered cardboard, and what's left of the promises? Fuck all, I'm guessing. Exactly. And that's when they reach for the stick they call values. Getting shelled in your dugout, tombs are taking refreshing phosphorus showers, and some officers ranting about loyalty and duty. The moment you stop shitting carrots and they wave the value stick, fucking run, rabbit. Run. Sounds like you got some shit to work through. Gotta face your demons sometime, Johnny. Didn't actually have a problem with them. Till now. Politicians, military runners, intelligence operatives, Colonel Hansen for dessert. All the rotten fish in one fucking barrel, this dog town. Don't turn around. Eyes on the corner. <laughs> Hands, what you holding? Ugh. Got this token? Mean anything to yes. you? I need to make sure. Keeps his cards close, this one. <clears throat> sent you. A mutual friend. We don't have mutual friends. Friends survived an accident. You might have heard. You might have. Zone defense, that. Keep pushing. Is she safe? Hard to say. No longer we sit here. That's it. Dribble around him. Are you followed? Are you about to check? Data was tailed. So you didn't check. So you still got a ways to go. We'll work with what we got. Black door in Merrimack, in the street. Three minutes, front seat. We better leave separately. 
Don't want anyone to get suspicious. Me first. Don't want to be caught holding hands? Breathe. Slippery motherfucker. I think we really hit it off. Sure. Betty's got candy in that van. Ready to find out? You know, man, the fuck Hansen got against the plane. Black Thornton. Used to the real bees at Corporal Plaza. And now? Before we go, apologies for the precautions. I only ever rest so much. Sometimes it's just safer to shove the barrel of a Malorian between a Chun's ribs, even if he is on your side. It's nothing personal. No hard feelings, I hope. No. No hard feelings. It's all good. Had to make sure. I'd have done the same. Is that so? You're not in the biz, V. Our biz. We don't have all Actually, day. Actually, I am, though. Just since yesterday. I was about to say your first time's out are the hardest, but I'm not gonna lie. I combed FIA data for info about you. Interesting profile. Freelance Merc. You were born in NC. Haywood. To make things more interesting, FIA agent. You received your commission last night. One thing eludes me. What drove you to get entangled in this mess? Songbird hired me. Know her? So me. Something up? We used to work together. I thought I heard the last about her, but... That girl's a magnet for trouble. Right. It's time we paid our friend in distress a visit. Address, please. Abandoned building on Crest Street, 8th floor. Left her alone in Dogtown. Was I supposed to drag her along while cruising around? Actually. Look, place seemed plenty safe to me. Safe? A derelict building in Dogtown. Just listen to how that sounds. Hold up. I need to take this. Why are you calling me on my day off? Last I heard. You're the manager. Ask Bob. He owes me a favor anyway. Yeah, well, tough nuts. You'd have to manage without me. Boss, man. I work the door at a club. Selection, you know, bouncing. <laughs> That's your Lilo gig? A bouncer? It pays the bills and nets me a little disposable. Sleeper agents aren't entitled to government pay. Not even under the table. Huh. This is not how I imagine spending my day off. Saving the president? Great action BD shit right there, am I right? 
Yeah, sure, I guess so. Does my eyes still smoke? Snitches get stitches, man. So that'll be a yes. Not good. When things start to spiral out of control, she's likely to light up. It's high time we help her out. Honestly, this is not inspiring confidence. Relax, she ain't alone. Made some new chooms. Locals. Introductions were a little dicey, but she turned on the charm. Probably has her Dogtown campaign staff by now. This keeps getting worse and worse. tried to extract her forcibly, this whole level would be in shambles. No way she would have gone quietly. Open up. It's me. Yeah, yeah, coming. Don't move. For fuck's sake. Again? Where is she? That's enough, gentlemen. Put your tools away, gents. Compare length and girth when I'm not around. You the boss. Are you sure? Look around. Positive. Hmm. You remembered my number. Some numbers you never forget. Never with me, Roslyn. You never intended to call that line. Well, I found myself in Night City with a bounty on my head. So it seemed the right moment to reach out, have a tete-a-tete, -tete, reset an old friendship. I'd offer to sit down and chat over coffee, but the clock's ticking. I need to arrange a passage for you to Washington. No, Reed. We need to talk first, all three of us. Come on, we should talk in private. The President, a merc, and a special agent walk into the Oval Office. Question is, where do I fit into this joke? You've seen the news. Uh-huh. Hansen's spin work never fails to amuse. He's not acting purely on his own initiative. Someone from our camp's propping him up. Hansen, any idea who he's in bed with? Roslyn has more enemies than you can count. This shit runs deeper, Reed. I wasn't alone on that flight. I heard so me was on board. Where is she now? V was the last person to talk to her. Most likely scenario? Got caught in some ice on the combat bot when she hacked it. One little mishack. Happens even to the best. But no way to know for sure. Mm-hmm. Unfortunately, we need hard evidence, not speculation. Reed, I needn't remind you what this means for the NUS's national security. Besides, she's your prodigy, Saul. You taught her all your tricks. Hell, even recruited her. She and V have a unique... Uh, bond. It's a lead. 
our only one for now. You two have to find her. Together. I already died for the cause once. Not enough? What do you mean you died already? What has Myers told you about me? Said you'd let an intelligence cell here. Went into hibernation at war's end. So she omitted the fact that Arisaka tried to smoke me. <clears throat> and that I ended up in intensive care with three bullet holes. That six months had passed before I could take a shit on my own. Might have slipped her mind. Convenient. Well, now you know. Let me get this straight. You abandon Reed and Nancy. Leave him for dead, and now expect him to jump right back into shit? Newsflash, Madam President. Got a hell of a debt to pay. You're right. I'm sorry, Reed. For those seven years. Is that enough? To get us a fresh start? I'm here, I'll help. But I'm doing it for Somi, and my country. Call me naive if you like. As for you, V, you said in the car a songbird hired you, correct? I don't know how much he's paying, but you better ask yourself, is it worth it? Something's more important than Eddie's, Reed. That we agree on. We all got our reasons. Mine's even got a name. The Relic. If I don't find so me, I'm literally a dead woman. Seems we're all on the same page now, V. Which means we can help each other, too. Agreed. Think so, too, Reed. If we want to find Somi, we got to dig deep. I mean, actual reconnaissance. No stone unturned. We need contacts, informers not afraid to sing, who might see something in it for themselves. You'll need to earn their trust. That yeah, big ask in Dogtown. Won't be easy. I need to arrange a safe passage to Washington for Myers. Expect my call soon, V. Thanks. For everything. Buy me a nice dinner sometime. <laughs> you do this often? Invite presidents out on dates? Often enough. Okay. Dinner it'll be. She's gotta survive till then. Alright, I need to make some calls.
more time, I... Help! That's weird. <laughs> Tracking me? In Dogtown? No, no, not you, the car. Listen, I'll explain, but first, you gotta bring her to me. Flipping you the coins. V, you scan this motherfucker? Gonked again. Prim looking, but useless. At least with you, it's the other way around. Wait, what? Ah, <laughs> relax. Just teasing, man. Anyway, come on. If I wanted my dick wet, I wouldn't stand out in the rain. This one's stolen too? 
Stolen? Well, v, you're breaking my heart. Give it to me straight, Cap. The wheels. What's your scheme? Got a need for speed, huh? Yeah, me too. But first, I'm not gonna haze you. The car you brought's looking a little worse for wear. Every scratch is a loss, you feel me? Two, I'm selling them. Three, Dogtown's full of chances, and chances are what I like. Four, you called it a scheme? Man, I prefer to call it a, a creative license. Like to call things by their names, Captain. Your squirmy song and dance won't work on all me. All right, all right, chill. We don't gotta like each other. Just gotta rake in the eddies. Listen, I got like a gift. A sixth sense. I can tell when a ride's bored. Needs a change of hands. Sometimes I hear him calling over in Dogtown. Sometimes in Night City. Right, and this sixth sense tells you to tell me to bring him to this chop shop? Ooh, chop shop. Well, please. But, yeah, you rein in the wheels, you rake in the heads. Of course, it's all part of a larger plan. Well, well. Picked up a tail, huh? No, I don't think so. Relax, we're in my hood. Let's see what they want. NCPD asshole. You got a license and a ridge for them ugly mugs? I don't fucking believe this. Badge has got a talent for looking the other way. Suggest you try using it. The mouth on this one. Training them better and better. Daniels, the fuck, man? You take a fucking squad car to pick up a clipped ride in uniform? Not the only one on his home turf, mama. Hey, Nabaville Fort Alvarado for the top breast, too. I'll get the gear for our little plan. Hold the phone. El Cap handing out bribes? I'm shocked. Shocked. There an honest cop left in this city? There is. But they lay low. Don't got that fire in their eyes, you know? Prem, thanks for the cred. Cars, deets, and docks are on their way. You see? It's just biz. Come on, rain stopped. Okay, you just met one of our clients. So, in on the gig? Always driving somewhere. Might as well pick up some scratch on the way. You gonna make it worth my while? Come on, man. With El Capitan, your future's looking bright. I fix you your gigs, your fancy payouts, nothing but upsides. Counting on it. Sure, sure. Let's see what tomorrow brings. El Capitan will be in contact.
Dr. Domingo. A crime has been reported. Roger, dispatch. Standing by for coordinates. to patrol. I... my bad. Yeah, I'm sorry. So... Yesterday, I was sitting around, a little bored. Figured I'd hack a Nikola ad. Damn thing reset itself in five minutes. <laughs> Didn't get one measly pick out of it. Been up to any dumbass nonsense yourself? <laughs> 